Hi everyone. So in this demo, we are going to discuss how to create table or grid in Sketchflow. So first, I'm going to the left where I can see assets and I'm going to search for grid and it gives some number of different options related to grid. I'll go for the first one which says data grid and when you mouse over on this it gives a small descriptions which says displays data in a customizable grid. I'll just go and drag and drop it on my workspace. And the next, I need some datas in this grid. Again, Sketchflow has a very beautiful option to create datas. So in right side, we can see properties, resources, and data. I'll go to the data part. And we can see here there are two small options or I can say small icons. When I click on this icon, it gives me the options new sample data, import sample data. So I'll go for the new sample data and it'll give some name, let's say table, and I'll define in project and I'll say OK. The moment I say OK, we can see here we are getting the two properties default. This is something which I can go and edit and in simple language I can say this is it's a column header so I'll say name I'll say address let's say I have I need one more I can just go and add it from here let's say images and this by clicking this icon which says edit sample values it takes me to this one more pop-up screen where I can go and edit all the columns. So we can see here that this is a small down arrow. If I click that down arrow, it gives me a one ply out which says what kind of or what type of data I need. By clicking this, it gives me string, number, boolean, image. So anything which is related text it goes under the string if I need any numerical data I'll say number if I need any yes no check boxes boolean kind of data I'll say boolean and if I need images I'll say images so let's see I need I'm going and selecting the image and here we have a browse option by which I can browse and get my images in case if I don't have any images it pulls to some default images from Sketchflow structure and the next is image it says header says oh sorry I should go and make this string because I I should have some addresses here so when I say string it gives me some address options so let's see the the data which are coming here it come it's coming in the some address some randomly is coming in the address format in image I'll go and make this as an image and I'm done say okay I know it's very simple I so I did two things the first dragging the grid and putting on my workspace and second I created my data sample so now the third task, binding this data with grid. So I just need to click this collection from the right side and just need to drag on the grid which is there on my workspace. And here's the output. To run this, I'll go to project and then run project and we can see the output so 
see here we have a very beautiful grid thanks everyone